full card painting most of the time looks very simple, but it has some kind of magnetism and is always modern, it never goes out of fashion. This is an artistic language that is understandable to everyone, even to children. Are you an artist, an illustrator or digital illustrator or craftsman or you have no idea how to paint at all? Then this class is for you. Fall card is a good starting point for beginners, as well it can enrich artistic language of advanced artists and make your signature style unique. Hi everyone, my name is Irina De Vicente and I'm Russian folk artist, digital designer and a teacher based in Spain. I studied academic drawing and oil painting and later history of art in the Art Academy of St. Petersburg in Russia. But last years of my life I dedicated to folk art and it brings me a lot of joy. To say the truth, I paint every day. In this class I will teach you to paint one of the most popular motifs in Hochloma folk art style – strawberries. We will paint with a brush and paint, as the Hochloma artist started to do it more than 300 years ago. The secret of the long-term success of the berries motif is in strict rules and canons. For a long time Hochloma painting was a closed knowledge, like a secret information. No one in the Soviet Union knew how to paint Hochloma, except for artists from the factory, the Hochloma factory, and some single folk art teachers. I got this knowledge in the modern time of Russia from a professional artist of Hochloma. Today I will tell you the secrets of the strawberry composition so that you can repeat it on any surface and any size without losing harmony, proportions and the pace of the composition. The final project of the class will be this composition with such delicious juicy strawberries. It looks quite simple, but it requires a certain accuracy. Therefore, please follow my easy step-by-step -step instructions and you will definitely succeed. Even my small students paint with me and then participate in the children's exhibitions, for instance. First, we will make a sketch with pencil and then we will paint it over with paint. You just need a piece of paper, a glass of water, palette or plate, a round brush and paint. Acrylic, gouache, tempera or vinyl paint, it doesn't matter. How can this composition be applied? As you can see, I have painted my strawberries on the box to demonstrate to you how you can decorate any box, for example. You can also paint your handbag, backpack, clothes, sketchbook, plate or tray, any decor item. Well, and the most joyful option, I guess, is to create a postcard and give it to a dear person. This is what we are going to do in this class. To make this class even more interesting and useful, I have prepared such a freebies for you. The workbook includes exercises on the practice of elements and also additional compositions that you can easily paint by yourself. This way you will have even more artworks after this class. Additionally, I am attaching a guide on building a composition of class project with all measurements in inches and in centimeters. If you would like to know what is the Hochloma style is, I recommend you to watch the history of Hochloma art lesson in my class Russian Mandalas here on Skillshare. In this short 8 minutes video you are going to follow the history of this folk art style from 17th century till nowadays. Watch it right now, believe me, it is very interesting. Follow my Instagram where you can find both my hand-painted and digital artworks and videos of creating process. Let's be Insta friends! I invite you to my world, world of decorative painting, with artistic language of fairy tales, when you can transform your reality into fabulous illustrations. I will be waiting for you in my class.